Guten Tag, and welcome back to the Fritz Carlton. We're here at the Grease Ridge Mall in Greece, Empire State. And it's not even Thanksgiving yet, but we're all ready to roll. But on this uh, episode of the Fritz Carlton, I continue the cooking show and we do some stock and bake off some lobster tails. Uh, and then in the middle unit, I get set to remodel the kitchen floor with some laminate floors. And then also at the end of this episode, I go on the hunt to capture Tony the cat. So stay tuned, grab a tasty beverage, and enjoy the clip. Keep getting our chicken stock going. <clears throat> Let's see what other uh, preparations we got for today's show. I got a list over here. That's the chicken stock there that I got out of there. I just stuck it in a pickle jar. So uh, tonight's menu is going to be lobster. All right, we prepared the lobster. Some shells on top, some seasoning, some lemon juice. I'll break that off. And then I think got a pork tenderloin to cook off too. All right, we seared off our uh, pork tenderloin. Let's see how our lobster's been. Oh yeah, she's still got a way to cook. Uh, they're looking good in there, I can smell them. Alright, here's our finished product on the uh, lobster tails. We're going to transfer them over to a plate and then uh, get the pork tenderloin back in the oven and bake it. And that will conclude tonight's show. Okay, I just uh, bought a bunch of laminate for us so we can uh, redo the kitchen in here and carry out this. To, uh, that's the place I gotta come in here and move all this stuff out of here and prep it up. Make it like a sort of a uh, nice floor in the kitchen. So I'll move all this stuff out of here tonight. Get it ready. And then uh, we'll all be out here. Let's go look at the work uh, Ray did around the uh, oven for the show. As you notice, we got like a, the dryer problem here. It's like we can't get one to work for one reason or another. And this one's going back over to Carlton, but it's in transition to make sure we got the other one going. But remember before when I was doing the show that you could see the edge of uh, where the oven was to the cupboards, the gap. Hitted some tile on the side there. That way it doesn't look so... Uh, Ghetto-ish. I'll pull the oven out here and take a look at it. Um, so he just added on like uh, some extra tile, and that made it all the way flush. So you can see. So now it looks a lot better, opposed to having that rough uh, cut edge there. So we'll go back to production and moving everything around there and get ready for the floor for the next cooking show over in the new kitchen. Because I gotta rent this one out and we'll be moving the show over to four. Okay, so we cleaned up the uh, kitchen. We gotta still do a quick sweep. And now she's emptied out. And then uh, pulled out from the yeah, fridge and the stove. Get ready to start cleaning this place up. Make it a little more uh, livable. Alright, here's the material. We're just waiting for our man. Do up the top of laminate floor. So the kitchen will move over here tomorrow. So orange segments or uh, tangerine segments with some uh, pear. I'm gonna mix them up with yogurt. And then uh, continue to peel the garlic to fill up the pickle jar so uh, 
to make a pesto. And for extra credit tonight, we gotta try to catch some wild cats that are uh, moved into this trailer back in Ike's yard. And there it is, right there. It's just right above the fence. There's a little hole, like right there. They've been crawling. There's like three of them. And one of the cats is from one of the tenants that lived on the other side of the driveway. And uh, she got evicted and moved out like two months ago. So this cat's been living like a wild cat. And he's got two of his buddies hanging out with him in there. So I'm going to try to catch him in that cage and return Tony to Eva. So that's the other project I got going on. Alright, this is uh, the next phase of moving out of the kitchen over here so we can bring the show. Got to get a new countertop and uh, call the baseboard. Backsplash. Yeah. For uh, the kitchen. Clean it up in here, all the clutter. But yeah, production's rolling right along. Old and the new, and that'll just tie it right into the living room and the bedrooms for the upstairs of the FBC. So, totally running out of tape, so I'll just keep video on. And this will be the studio in here eventually. I promised it last year, but as time allows. And you still gotta go catch those cats from that little thing over there. So that'll be the project too. Okay, there's our cat, Tony. Now the goal is to catch him and get him back to his rightful owner without getting scratched up. So. And we'll live just a few minutes later. I'm back, and the floor is pretty much done. So, next we'll go for uh, more tile and uh, countertop stuff. But now I'm going to go try to catch Tony. Good job. Okay, here's the videotape of uh, the cage. And then uh, back over here we got our buddy Tony hanging out on Ike's trailer. So I'm going to go try to catnap him and get him in the cage and get him back to his rightful owner. And then uh, clean up this place and get it ready to rent out tomorrow. Do the cooking show, so. Uh, I caught Tony the cat finally, so uh, the rightful owner is going to pick him up. So the... Alright, I hope you enjoyed today's clips of my ongoing cooking show where I reduce the chicken stock and cook off a couple lobster tails. Then also in the middle unit, um, I remodel the kitchen floor with the laminate and then I even capture Tony the cat but the sad truth it was the wrong cat it wasn't the tenant so it was the capture that backfired. I hope you enjoy these videos as uh, I tour America and uh, get the latest different shots and drive safe Alvita Sane from the Fritz Carlton.